need an introduction. Uh, uh, just going to say, uh, go on, just give us your time. Yeah, no, hi, Sajid Jared, Member of Parliament for Bromsgrove, Secretary of State for Communities. Should people uh, tolerate a hate crime? Absolutely not. Your hate crime comes in your many forms and it's obviously unacceptable whenever it occurs, wherever it occurs. And the number one thing I encourage people that do unfortunately suffer from any kind of hate crime is to report it. The government's trying really hard to get more people to report it. It's the only way that we can make sure we're doing enough to combat it. And that's why today we are having this kind of stall, making people aware of what it is, when it happens, what you can do with it, what your rights are, is so important. Would you say there's enough police to, to deal with the, the increase in hate crime recently? I think the police have been doing a fantastic job, uh, but they do rely on people coming forward and reporting it to them. Um, but also, uh, I think it's more than just the police, because you know, the best thing to do, obviously, is not to have the hate crime in the first place. Sadly, when it gets to the police, clearly something's happened. But I think we can do more to educate people about you know, what happens, why it occurs, and how they can help stop it. Should they ignore it? No one should ignore it. It should never be ignored. So at what stage should they be reporting it? Is it a case of where things get worse or is it a case of at the early stages? Well, as, as soon as uh, anyone experiences any kind of hate crime, be it sort of based on religion or sex or whatever it is, they should uh, report it and they should report it immediately to their local police. And local police today, they know exactly what to do, but again, they rely on the report. Is it a criminal offence? Absolutely. Thank you very much. Thank you.